Bro, I did my whole intro and then I didn't even realize I was muted. Okay. I mean, there's no point in doing my intro now, I guess. Fuck. Uh, oh, shit. I'm not supposed to curse. What's up, guys? It's Jay Orca. I'm back with another stream. Hey, I. Ah, oh, damn. Damn, bro. I didn't even realize my shit was lagging. I mean, my mic wasn't on. It's all good though, I, I hope. An uncommon proposition, okay. It's Dixa at Ailes, Rob Style. I feel like my stream is a little too laggy. Let me quickly. Oh my god, what is up with my stream? What the hell? Bro, what the hell, bro? Let me quickly change it. Alright, hopefully this time my stream quality isn't that bad. It's still gonna be bad though. I mean like the quality is gonna be bad, the, the FPS is gonna be- oh my god. I don't know why my game is- My game is just doing the most, bro. Dad. His household is as poorly run as his land. Estrid is a good wife. Lord. Ah, a heroic looking Dane in our midst. I am looking for Beerstan, the elderman of this shire. Our lord is not at home, but his wife is receiving visitors upstairs in her usual fashion. If you speak with her, pass on that we've run out of ale. Estrid is a good wife. Far better than he deserves. You would say that, Adrian. Your wife acts like a sow in a skirt. My sweater runner's a worthy woman, you coxcomb. But uh, she's I, an I gotta look cook. for what? With a fine nose for truffles. If Bilston does not return soon, go. Okay. wine will not be the only thing spilled upon his floors. Now, gentlemen, everyone is fractious with this waiting. Uh, let me see what this is. Disrespect you, lady. Hi there. You! Gods will come at one cry from me! Sheathe your blade, lady. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan, here at your husband's request. Another Dane. I am Estrid, wife of the Lord of Essex. As you may have heard, my lord is not at home. I am weary of rounding up Saxons. Is your husband stolen, drunk, or wayward? He'll be stalking the woodlands today, hunting game and ignoring the vital affairs of Essex. One such affair is why we called for you. If I can find him, I will remind him of his duties. Ah, such would be a miracle. His favorite haunt is southwest of here. The lavender fields there attract the prey, God help him. With luck he hasn't been eaten, but I will return either way. That was a quick little flex on her. God damn. Alright, the quest started, so let's go. Let's go looking for this guy. Patience is a godly virtue, Adrian. Even the saints retired. Uh let me see on the map where it is. Damn, that's far. Mm. I think the best thing to do is travel here. Okay.
I gotta look for him. Show me what lies ahead. So he's in that circle, I bet. Hunting is a fine sport, but I hope the Elderman has not become the prey. Ooh. No good comes from a camp this bloody. There's mad dead people here, what? Why is he sitting up like that? They were caught off guard as they supped. The remains of the hunting party. This one was savaged by a large animal. Okay. They were attacked by a beast. Something strong enough to kill a horse. That horse is dead as hell, man. What the fuck? Some large prey left these tracks in the grass. The hunters were prey to a large beast or two. I can only hope that Beeston still lives. So where do Show I look me. Oh, so now I gotta look for him over here. Raining hard as shit. Is this him? Is. Ready your weapon or accept your fate as a feast for bears. Did this bear just this is really one do Saxon you won't kill. <laughs> Gets the oh, blood. That bear is actually Check my guy. Surrender. Do not let me charge you. That's how you kill a bear. I would not have survived this ambush without you. I know. Don't say the obvious, man. Come on. You have my gratitude to stumble upon me in my moment of greatest peril. Yeah, you're welcome, Perhaps man. you were God sent. I am Estrid sent. Your wife and the thanes of Essex both want your balls on a blacksmith's anvil. When do they not? You could return and report that the savage claw took me. Poor Beerstan, his exit pursued by a bear. And make the beast lord of Essex in death? your stead. Eh, that's not a bad idea. No oh, doubt my like Estrid yourself. would prefer his velvet paws to my calloused hands. So, who are you? A cell sword? What's a cell sword? Huh? I come to your call. I'm Norse, no mercenary. You seem ill. I'm I am Norse. Norse and no coin groveler. Intriguing. We Saxons hear only that Danes and Norse are ferocious barbarians. We are. All teeth and claws, with little subtlety or wit. Now we got but that too. Oh, are you the Norse I sent word to? Yeah. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. You hinted at an alliance for the loan of my unique talents. It's blood, yes. I mean, Let us return to Colchester at once, and we'll speak more of the delicate matter on my mind. I'm glad you answered okay. my summons. I did not expect such a skilled fighter. Why it's good I came when I did. Away. You lost many men on this hunt. Good men, all. They will have the proper rights, and their families will be cared for. <laughs> your people sacrificed much for your sport. They did. There is no balm for my tortured heart. Why did you ask me here? Do you believe in true love, Eivor? I have loved. But have you truly? Has a longing burned in your breast, a sweet lingering pain, paralyzing you with its sting? There is pain enough in battle. I do not seek it out in love. I long for it. The thrill of a fight softly won. My wife Estrid lacks fire. She is a fish out of water, cold and dead. She showed great passion when I met her, keeping your things in check. Oh, they love her, it is true. Some with too much devotion. And I have not been a good and attentive husband. 
I have always been a plucked goose in matters of love. And a piss-poor ruler to boot. Strong must be the hand that steers the ship, Beeston. My hand would rather tug the cat gut of a well-crafted bow. My eyes narrowing at the sight of prey. Aye. A crown sits heavy on the head. Then let us run wild and free in the woods as the wolves do. Live on our wits. Prowl and stalk and feast. You have a romantic way about your beast. And... Do not fret. My guards will not worry you when we are together. You must mark me if you think I'm capable of worry. Have you built your city in the ruins of another? No. These builders are lost to the annals of time. Far advanced of the Saxon hovels of Wattle and Daub. I have ambition to build a great palace myself, with mosaics and balmy courtyards. What stops you? That which stops all but the most creative minds. Coin, imagination, talent. And your people? Is Essex happy? That is a question I never really ponder. I suppose they are. I hope they are. Alfred believes I rule like a chickless hen. Flapping and squawking over nothing but the farmer's dinner. He interferes. No, he disapproves. Is that not infinitely worse? But look, we are nearing my hall. I must face the wolves at my door before we discuss your favor to Essex, Abel. It may be I can speed your business along. And now what do I do? Do I talk to this guy? Come and he and the to This guy is a lazy ruler. What the? Okay, I can't say that. Ready to help me fend off the spears of their displeasure? Let them speak their woes. I'll advise you if I can. Who is this owl, Beeston, that twitters in your ear? An advisor, nothing more. Here to help Essex navigate her brewing storms. Now, my dear brethren. Adrid, perhaps you will start us off. What troubles you? You're a disgrace, Beerstan. Couldn't get a sow pissed in an alehouse. Alfred's men are crawling hey, all over king. Essex. King Alfred, yes. Though it is within his right, the constant presence of his men is certainly an issue. Are they men or babes? If Alfred meddles in the affairs of Essex, sends me home in shrouds. Ah, we should challenge his right to rule. Was not Essex once a thriving kingdom of its own? We should fight, yes, fight! And you, Wyatt, what do you say? <clears throat> Your preparations for the Lammas Festival. How can you think of spending so much coin when your people are starving? This guy's fat. He knows he wants to eat. But yeah, let's see what the right answer. Wine and song, you should come to be festival. Starving, yes, that is not good. I'll see to it. I'm not doing too And Aldrich, good do you yap like a she-hound as Adrid does? You know my thoughts, Beerston. The field. How can we give men to Alfred for his wars when our harvest suffers day by day? Do they not defend your land? You'll need all the men you can muster to fight the coming wars. The okay, Danes are a great the... threat when provoked. Oh, shit, but, Those we cannot ally with, we must fight or lose our lands. There! Yeah, but... Have I not answered all your questions? You are a stain on this shire, Beerstan. Useless. Useless. That's right. Yet still you haunt my hall. Be gone. I haven't time for your squabbling. That's right. I'm the king. You gotta listen to me. I mean, he's the king. You, you gotta listen to him. Yep. You're certainly a better hunter than you are a diplomat, Eivor. I spend my effort where it matters most. All this talk of hunting makes me long for the woods. Your wife awaits, Spearston. Are you not worried some other man will drench your sheets with his sweat? Ha! <laughs> she does as she must. As do I. But you will discover this soon enough. Is this guy a cock? What? 
If I catch them cheat, okay. You have done the impossible, Dane. Returned my errant gander to his coop. My pettish love. Such a stormy countenance clouds the sun of my return. Your thanes drank the ale the abbot gifted us. All of it. Now that is a tragedy my heart will not easily overcome. If he looked at me with the same affection he shows for hunting deer, our marriage might have survived. I noticed your love has gone sour. Was it fresher than this? <laughs> there is so little difference between love and hate, it's difficult to say where the sourness comes from. So, what do you need of me? Our affairs are more of heart than of state, Eivor. What little passion there was between us faded into bickering long ago. We would have our freedom, Eivor. I from my wife, and my wife from Essex. I am too sharp a weapon for so soft a task. Why not part and be done with it? Oh, were I a Dane, and divorce as simple as a slit throat. But it's not so easy as that. Damn, divorcing in these times are probably, probably really hard. Does your god not allow husbands and wives to part? Our god? Our king? There is much standing in the way of a joyous uncoupling. Ours was an arranged marriage, a political need, and not oh. easily broken. Explain yourself, an clear and plain, marriage? and I will do it. I the poetry it. here is mind mud. We had a plan, a simple plan. A woman lost and a woman found. Some time ago, we paid a Dane to kidnap me and ferry me safely to Francia. As you can see, he did not deliver. He was certainly thorough in other regards. Some Norse can be quick to take coin and slow to earn it. If I give my word, it is not broken. Could we try the kidnap again? Much of the planning is done. It would only take a more trustworthy overseer. It should be a bold venture if we she do. She wants to get Loud kidnapped and rash and just seen so by all. The love. During our Lamas festival, merry peasants Save? and guards with what? wandering eyes. Your return to Frankia would need a swift ship with a captain ready to leave England. We could ask him. I would have thought his steed and seamen spent. Come find me in the market, Eivor. Our unwelcome guests require food and ale to soften their anger. My wife is a gracious and attentive host, Eivor. The only thing that keeps my brain thanes at bay. And the woman found? A darling Maybud, Alvida, my childhood sweetheart. I left her twenty years ago in Malden to marry my prickled pear. Twenty years? Can an ember so cold be reignited? We can hope. You must fan the flame. Find her, bring her to my lakeside cottage, and light a bonfire there. I will know to come. I believe she lived in the last house in Malden. A small, sweet place where fond memories were made. I will do as you both ask, and ask Freya for success in this love game. Good luck in your endeavors, Eivor. I pray you find my Alvida with a fair face and a yearning heart. Now, should I look for Alvida first, or meet with Estrid at the marketplace? I'm gonna look for the other one first. I'm being honest. I'm gonna do this first only because she can be found later on I guess yeah
This place would have been impressive once, a long time ago. You die now! You're mine! I don't know why they're trying to attack. Yeah. Ah, focus, we have this. It's clear we got the I came first to help you. Your needs seemed more pressing. And now my marriage awaits your executioner's sword. Will it not be strange to leave this place? You have lived here half your life. Yes, but what is to keep me here? A loveless union and the dirt mounds of two babes who never took a breath. You speak with some sadness. Has your time here always been tragic? There have been tears, but also great passions. Love, foolishness, regret. Yet, is that not all lives? The best lived of them? And what of our plan, the Great Lama's Kidnap? Is this a Christian feast? Yes, it's a wonderful evening. A blessing of the harvest, full of fruits and fires, drinking and dancing. Revelers with muddy minds and glazed eyes. That's good for us. And what of the ship that will sail you home? I know just the one. And her captain is full of fire. Come, I will take you to him. This place would have been impressive once, a long time ago. I was there. I saw it. This captain, who is he? Not much more than a boy in his 17th year. Full of youthful bravado. A Saxon. Oh, a Dane, a though Adred calls you raiders, he says that you are here to steal England. Some may be. But I've come to settle a stretch of land. I'm not so keen to return to the winters of my birth in Norway. Norway? Ah! It must be beautiful. Rugged and fearsome, and cold as anything, the frozen north. So cold that the light hangs in the sky. A road for the Valkyries who carry our dead warriors to their eternal feast. An eternal feast would be a merry end. How is my stream so laggy? What the? We are here. This is a brothel. The captain's name is Rolfur called Rollo in my tongue. Tell him of our new plan and agree to whatever reward he demands. He may take some convincing, for we did not part on the best of terms. I will bring him round by force or persuasion. Just be ready for my signal at the Lama's festival. Okay. Uh, I'm walking into a bathroom now, so... Uh... Rollo! <laughs> Oh, he's going in. Please, I'm just a poor Christian brother with nothing left to give. Oh. Oh. Someone's at the door, Rolla. Oh, is it that hun I asked for? Um, I think I'm gonna Esther be demonetized. Me. Did she now? Yeah. As a parting gift for the man who rattled her bones, huh? <laughs> No, I'm here to collect you. Can it wait? Oi! Bring out the one they call Rolo. The king's men want to ask him a few questions. No, 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 no! Just a second! Good day, sir. Come in. Move! Move! Some help here! Bloody fucking Danes! Open this door! Out! Now! Follow me! <laughs> we found your captain! So like, what am I supposed to do again? No one's out here now! Thank you! Surrender! Roll all the improvements!
Oh, that shit was light. Ah, my fucking stream is laggy, but let's see what he has to say, I guess. Can you speak, bro? Estrid did not lie. You have fire. And who are you to Estrid? Only a friend. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Norse by the music of your speech. Then you must forgive me. Those Saxons knew about my camp. I was mind drunk to leave my warriors behind. Go to your men if you must. Only tell me where to find you. We have much to talk about. Northeast of here, by the river's mouth. Follow me or come when you can. I bet. Okay. I gotta go there. I bet. There it is then. I don't want to fight, but he, but he was instigating it, bro. What the heck? I can just run away out. No. He don't even know where I am anymore. Come on. gonna keep wanting to hurt me? What's up with that? What is all that? What the fuck? God damn. Are those bushes? What is that? No. <laughs> what is this? Why are my people bound? What happened? It's worse than I feared. Damn, all so your people many are dead. Of my people gone. That's tough. And the rest at each other's throats. They believe one of your number is a traitor? Lork and Gerhild have been at my side all season. I don't like to doubt them, but my people are taken and my ship is gone. If the traitor lives, all of you are at risk. Let me talk to them. The innocent have nothing to hide. Very well. But do not let Loki whisper lies in your ear. While you were drinking and whoring, Rollo, the Saxons attacked us. And these two were nowhere to be found. Have you made your decision? What am I supposed to do? On second thought, perhaps there is more to be learned. Neither betrayed us, Ake. I Get forgot what I'm supposed to do, to be honest. And Lork uh. served my father well. Seems like the Saxons didn't get all of Rollo's clan. I should speak to both and see if I can find some evidence around the camp. Where? Oh, from these guys, okay. The camp is well stocked with fresh rabbits and game. Um, I bet. This looks like a good spot to hide. Somewhere to wait out a Saxon attack. Lork, yes? What is your story? You want to hear my story? 
and bring me a mug of ale, and we'll sit and talk as equals. Elsewise, you can have. Where were you when the Saxons came? Hunting rabbits, wasn't I? Sick to death of carrots and turnips. Then I heard Gerhild shouting, and all hell broke loose. Did you see anything at all? Gerhild talking with a Saxon. Couldn't hear them, but wasn't nothing good. Sure of that much. Why should I believe you? You could be lying to save your own skin. Ask her. Says she's loyal to Rollo, but I've known her since she was a babe. Full of spite and ambition, always was. Damn, this guy's getting interrogated in medieval time. That's tough. How long has your sword served Rollo? I owe his father a blood oath. If that means wiping Rollo's arse until I die, so be it. And if Rollo was dead, that oath would be fulfilled. You must tire of battle. I'll feast in Odin's Hall one day, but not with the stain of dishonor on my hands. All right, but... You're lying. I found a rack full of game nearby, enough to feed the camp for days. Told you! I was hunting. Stick to that story and I'll tell Rollo to take your treacherous head. I was sleeping in the forest, wasn't I? Heard Saxons tramping through the tree, so I hid. Not fool enough to face him on my own. I have what I need for now. Alright, next person. Gerhild, is it? Aye! Rollo's sworn sword sister. I've served him proud and true. You cannot think I betrayed him. You were not here when the Saxons attacked. I was hunting! There's fine game in the trees outside the camp, and our people need meat. You know she's what lying. What was your prey? Rabbits for twitching stew. Like hell. Rolo's favorite. All right. Who are you to Rolo? I am shield sworn, so long as England and that Frankish witch do not sway him from the true path. Our people deserve better. I hear envy, but of Estrid or Rolo, I cannot tell. You know nothing, Ravenbeak. My concern is for my fellow Danes. You'll find no treachery here. All right. Log accused you of treachery. He saw you with the Saxon. Log? You believe that old crow? His bones crumble and his mind wanders with age. Or he wallows in jealousy. Take your pick. You're lying. I found rags and rags of game. You've got more wit than your face suggests. I went to meet a lad from a nearby village. Rolo's not the only one who dallies with locals. Damn, she a slut. I mean, she, she a city girl. God damn. That is all for now. While you were drinking and whoring, Rollo, the Saxons attacked us. And these two, have you made your decision? Gerhild claimed to be hunting, as Lorch did. Rabbit. She rarely hunts. She's been a terrible shot since we were children. Your shield sister is jealous. She thinks you neglect your people by sleeping with the enemy. She always had ambition. But she accepted my leadership. Swore on her shield. Lork saw her with a Saxon. She claimed he was her lover. Yet she has berated me many times for taking Estrid to my bed. I did not think her a hypocrite. Lork said he was hunting, but your rags are full of fresh rabbits. Why would he lie? Unless he had something to hide. He tires of his blood oath, and with your death, he would be free. He has become old and frail, but he served my father well. I would have freed him without bloodshed. This man knew the Saxons were coming and hid. He was either in league with them, or a coward. A sad fall for a great warrior no longer in his prime. Have you come to a firm conclusion? I have. Let me hear it. Both choices will pain me, but let it be the truth. I think the traitor is the the woman. Gerhild betrayed you. No, that's not true. Rollo, I beg you. That's a shameful tough. death. On bloody Saxon soil. Both had reason to betray their Jarl, but only one had the eyes on to do so. 
I hope you chose well, for you denied them a seat in my hall. There can be no feast in Valhalla for a break faith. She was always a jealous crow, beak pricking over every decision I made. Nothing more can be done here, but your warriors might still be alive. And I will need your help after they are free. There's a Saxon camp with a dock at Port Walton. It might be they were taken there. I don't know what I just... What the hell is happening, man? Oh my god. My heart is torn. Go. Find something useful to do. Alright, I guess I'm gonna look for something in that area. Is this crawling with enemies? Uh, okay. Alright, just watch me uh kill everyone. Head on. Unless there's like a, a bell. Is there a bell? Okay, so I do see a bell. The question is, is there one more than one bell? I gotta shoot the bell first. Okay. The gods here are vigilant. Go away. Oh, 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 oh. The bell! We must ring the bell! Try ring the bell, I dare you. Ah. No one can hit the bell anymore, like bro. I don't too good, bro. One, two, brother. I'm assuming games like Assassin's Creed. Let's see. Watch my lead. We must ring the bell. You know what? I don't even think I could finish that thought. Is there anyone else which is alive? Come here, come here. Snuff you out! Man, get the fuck out of here. No. Let me quickly stomp on him. Yeah. He's dead. He is confirmed dead. Okay. Now the question is... How do I get into the house? How do I get into the house? So, I gotta go in from here, right? But where's my precious chest? How's it more end? Let me kill That's light work. That's even lighter work. Let's go. Anyone else? But anyone 
anyone else. <gasps> I guess there's no more enemies, I bet. We good then. These houses just built the same, what the fuck? Find the key. Oh, the key's up there, I bet. Okay. I'm not sure if this guy knows that his buddies are dead, but... So even this has a complicated way to go. Bro. How do I enter this place? What the hell? Okay. Bro. Where's this key though? Did the guy have the key? What the fuck? Okay. See what this gives. I don't think much. And I see some more over there. Alright, it's time to free the guys. Done right by me. Rolo's men are free. Now we discuss the terms of the kidnap. To the dock! Make the ship ready to sail! Your axe arm is strong, Rolo. Never doubt me, Raven Feeder! These Saxon king slaves did. I need someone with a swift wave steed in good repair to bring the Lady Estrid across the sea to Frankia. Another kidnap scheme. Estrid is unshakable. All right then. Let we two triumph where one failed. I need you stout-hearted in this, whatever your passions for Estrid. We had our time together. Now that's done. I will not fail you here, nor her. We will meet with your men inside Colchester on the night of the Lama's festival. Okay. So what am I supposed to do now? Alright, 
first and foremost, I'm gonna put my skills, my uh, my points into something, into a skill. And yeah, I'm gonna go back to living life. I guess the next thing to do is that. Go find the king and his old girl. Olvida remember a lover from so long ago. Would I? <laughs> Aid me. Be my eyes. I gotta see someone here. The last house in Malden. Olvida should be here. So is he supposed to be here? Or anything, I gotta kill this guy. That's light. Someone was interrupted preparing their supper. Taken or fled. A second bed. Olvida doesn't live alone. Hey, yo. A spilled pail of water. Someone was in a hurry. Is she hiding here? Leave me be, warmonger! You have my sister! Is that not enough? Peace, boy. I'm not with these men. I came to speak with your sister, that's all. A day in Essex. Now here's a day riddled with strange portents and happenings. Do you know where they're holding Alvida? Yet another stay at the King's pleasure. The prison camp at Brentwood, far to the west. I'll bring her to the lake house north of there. Meet us there if you wish. If you promise you will find her, I will. Alright, but I'm gonna find your sister then. Since you can't. <laughs> Alright, you know, I don't know why I'm throwing shots at him, but. Alright, it's time to find this guy's sister. Knock on my trusty horse. Nearby, I guess. What do you see soon? They're over there, okay. I mean, it don't matter. You know, I could take on a whole fucking army. Boom. Ah, let's see. She's somewhere there, okay. Okay, enter through here. But let me Save see where the, the bells area are. Soon as soon as I see the bell, I'm gonna have to cut it. I, mean, I don't see no bell, but Wait, where the fuck is the bell? 
These guys don't have a bell? Oh, these guys are gonna die now. On his ass, boy. This must be Pearson's love, Alvida. They haven't broken her spirit. All right, I'm gonna try getting to her. I will need to find a key. You won't cage me like an animal. Cock tossers. What? Why is this? You're not one of them. Stay quiet. I'm here to free you. I cannot walk. My ankle. They were not gentle with me. Then I will carry you. Who are you? Who risked so much to save me? A friend. Of Elrich's? Is he all right? The poor boy? Not your brother. Someone else who wishes to rekindle a, a friendship. More than a friendship, I guess. Almost there. Set to put it on him. Ah, it's gone. <laughs> My ankle. Oh, the pain. Hey, you'll get through it. Alright, we home. Bless the saints! Here you are, sister, safe and well. How do I get her off? My bones ache. Oh! Rest now. Soon you'll be up and about again. Alright. A whole day passed. Let's see if she good. Alfida! Did they hurt you? Takes more than some cockshy milk sops to break my will. Beating a boy after death for stealing bread. I'll not see it done. Growling bellies mean nothing to those pay swords. Ellerich, pay more mind to the world. It is cruel and dark for those who cannot stand up for themselves. Alvida, could we speak in private? He is a good boy. But without a father to guide him, he's grown softer than I'd hoped. You raised him alone. Where were your parents when he was a child? Dead of the plague that came when he was three months born. So to shun your door when you have a babe on your teeth. Now it's your turn. Why did you come for me? I am here at the request of Elderman Beerston. He wonders if you could love him again. Love him? Dear old Beerston, he remembers. He does. I've thought of him sometimes myself. Oh, that's so cute. But with my brother to fend for... I could not waste a life mooning. He has thought of nothing but you, Alvida. And with his wife Estrid returning to Frankia, he sent me to find you. How it would work between me and him? I'm a poor woman. Have been always. Love knows no Elderman... fucking social class. Oh, Come on. God, help me. I'll give him a go. How could I not? 
Oh, bless. He will come if you call. At the lighting of the bonfire, he will ride here to meet you. Ellerich, come you and sit with us. I have something to say. And that's a happily ever after story. Or something like that. My... my apple blossom girl. Is it really you? It is. Though crows have left their footfalls around my eyes. They still shine brightly. As when we were children. Has Eivor told you all? Aye. She has. And do you accept me, love? My heart feels like it will burst. Now that you're reunited, what will you do? Are we reunited? I must hear it from your lips, Alvida. It has been many summers, and I have aged ungracefully. I will hear your wooing, Beerston. God help me, I've nothing to keep me in Molden. And this young lad is Elevich, Alvida's brother. Hello, your... your... worshipfulness? I am Beerstan, nothing more or less. And you are a fine, strong lad of... how old? Nineteen summers. He's all the family I have, oh. Bairston. If I'm to stay, you Here must you welcome us both into your heart. We have one half of our bargain done, Bairston. I will return with news of the other. Does this mean we're leaving Malden? You are, my boy. To live with me in Colchester. Good Perhaps shit. I can teach you the joy of the hunt. Before you go, Elovrich, I would suggest a long, slow walk around the lake. He's gonna have the dad he never had. This I should leave them to their reunion. The next piece of this drama is the kidnapping Colchester. Dear Bearston, I cannot believe Just you would come like for me after Just like 30 minutes all. ago, I entered some fucking... Bruh. There was nipples on the screen. Oh shit. Holy shit. Alright, let's go. A tree really got me. What the? Bruh. That's really powerful as fuck, god. Damn. Here. I'm not scared, what the fuck? The festival is on. The festival is underway. I should speak to Rolo about our plan. How are your people, Rolo? Recovered and ready for what tonight holds? Gerhild's treachery was a blow. Few were surprised it came to that, only that her dark ways took such a brutal turn. Put that aside. We're ready now. What would you have of us?
Unleash your war dogs. Set things afire. Bring panic. Act like the barbarians they think us to be. We'll stick their hearts with needles of fear. Night will fall soon. Then is our moment to strike. Really? Very well. Sooner well. doubt us work as shulam we don't sell her. A kitch may will and ascend and midway in a thumb meal in a room. She blind a waddler on lecherare. Time to do take their ale and their women. We will feast like kings tonight. Okay. Stand down, you Saxon dogs. The Lady of Essex is ours. Damn, I'm fucking getting killed. God damn. It was too easy, I guess. <laughs> Bro, how is there still so much? Like, will none of you Saxons save me? I'm out that shit. Yeah, I'm out. Fucking go, god damn. The 
Let's take a little minute, but we are safe enough to walk, I think. It's all good, aren't now. we? Oh, what a thrill! My heart is racing. Be glad it still beats at all. Your screaming drew half the guards in Colchester down upon us. I wanted to give a good performance. My father always said I was quite the actor. I won't deny your enthusiasm. Did you not have even a little fun? To steal away a princess. It did give a thrill. A woman fights bravely against her abductors. Yet, what will they do with me now? Is my virtue safe with you? It's not in danger, if that's what you mean. Come now, Evo. You can stand against Alfred's brutes, but you shudder at it. All right, good shit. I got her to the goal. It is done. And all that stands between me and my home now is a foaming ribbon of surf and silt. What do you mean by that? You did well, Rolo. You and your people. Are you ready to sail? Loki's hissing sun churns the waters between our coasts. We'll need time to rest as we wait for fairer weather. Have a care, then. Alfred's soldiers will be looking for Estrid, even if beer stands will not. Now's not the time for such worries, A4. Tonight, we celebrate! Let's get you some mead. I bet. Beerstan will meet you northeast of Colchester tomorrow. You have earned all my husband promised, and more. Come find me, if you like, away from these reveling Danes. All right, let's go. Thor's thunderous I should find Biston. No doubt he's hunting again. A ruse worthy of the trickster Loki. They're even stolen by us mere mortals. What lies ahead, I wonder? A new life, or an old life renewed? My old life, Frankia. Mon dieu, I feel as if I have been sleepwalking these past years, waiting for something to shake me awake. Isn't Rollo the man to shake you awake? He adores you. Rollo's still a boy, with boyish dreams. But he is honest. He could love you if you gave him a chance. It would be quite a match. Ah, oh, do you not know me better, Eivor? Mon petit coeur est blessé. Come, I am suddenly chilly. Let us join the others by the fire. Damn, I didn't say the right thing. I was about to get some buns, bro. Oh, that's tough. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's a survival. What the fuck? Such a terrible thing God, to happen yeah. on so holy a night. I always say to her, there's a little slouch. My son is to to go to Jimmy Finchet. It's Sunday and B, Debbie. Just 
to wait, Am I not supposed to be here? Get back here and face me! Best be watching. Oh -ho! With me, brother! <laughs> hey! Stop, hey. you! Go. I don't know what that all that was about, but damn. Where's my horse? Come here. Bro, my horse is just standing with a stalker behind me. Let's see you, old friend. Uh, your heart, who they, Percy? All you think of is what. Beerston, Estrid said you'd be here. Eivor, dear heart, you who drew back the bow of Eros and reunited me with my one true love. Have your things asked why you do not look for Estrid? Pish. They have asked, yes. I said it was hopeless. Then I lay upon my couch, sobbing and wailing. A pretty show. That may not be enough. Tut tut. The wind is soft upon our faces, and I am far from the whispering doors of Colchester. Come, let's hunt! Okay. You gonna get up or what? <laughs> the dog looks like Chop from GTA 5. What are we hunting now? Boar! A majestic animal, don't you think? Driven by a fierce fire, blazing eyes, and sword tusks. I once knew a strong armed shield maiden who rode a boar into battle. She named it Bristlebolt. How wondrously strange! Your tales are worthy of the hearing. We'll not ride our boars, but eat them. A feast in Alvida's honor. A feast for your mistress. Beerston, if this ruse falls apart, King Alfred will strip you of your title. Our alliance will be worthless. Have no fear. I shall be discreet. We will eat and sup at my hall with a few friends and family. It is there our friendship will be sealed. So soon after Lamas. Will people there not recognize me? No, you are just one more Dane. And in that chaos, who remembers anything but the screams of dear Estrid? These are your lands. I trust in your judgment. And how is Alvida? She is a firebrand. We have rekindled our love as if we were teenagers. Even Ellerich is a welcome addition. A younger brother to me, yet more alike to a son. The things I should like to teach him. Ah, hey, this that's is the spot. Here. The best boar here. The best boar here. Have a look, Sunan. Talking about over there. Okay, all right. <laughs> That's one. Come on, the feast table won't fill itself. <clears throat> hey, these boards are kind of far, though. That's a thing. Go, my eye. Do I really gotta go that far for boards? You will serve my love well, Hog. A haunch worthy of a <laughs> rival. <laughs> uh, 
I shall suck the scrumptious marrow from hey, your I got the bones, you yep. porcine devil. Kill Come that on, bitch. the feast table won't fill itself. This doesn't count, bro. Why is it running? Hey, that's another one killed. I see another one. Come on, the feast table won't fill itself. That's a headshot. <clears throat> and the last one's over there, okay. Let me see if I can headshot Come this. On, the feast table won't fill itself. Hey, I'm a go, bro. I'm a, I'm a go, well, bro. Able. Let me talk with Briston. Yeah, let me talk with him. A good hunt, Bierston. And enough for one day, I think. Even my thanes will not go hungry with this catch, and they are as voracious as wolves snatching at my carcass. They may give huh? you grief, but I have been nothing but amused. They're a welcome change to worrying Jarls and piss sudden politics. You have brought us all true happiness, Eivor. I thank you from the bottom of a heart full up with joy. Hey, I'm Beer happy to hear it. The heart hound who sought his true love by searching the sad haven mm -hmm. of his memory yep. and finding her there. Beautifully said, my friend. Poetic. Beautifully said. Come, Percy, you hapless hound. Barely a boar worried. I do not know why I keep you in my employ. Alright. Alright, I guess I gotta go there now. It made me go to a lot of places, but it's all good, I guess. What are your plans for Essex and your family? There is much that is new in this old place. Hurry back, Beerston. I will join you later for the feast. There is much that is new. Hurry back, Beerston. I will join you later for the feast. So I'm racing against him to get to where we're supposed to be. That's kind of trippy. See anyone? I'm gonna kill them. So I'm not even worried. <laughs> Home and hearth never used to stir the soul as the hunt did, but now. You promised we would never be apart, not for one waking or sleeping moment, and already you're sneaking out to hunt. <laughs> for the feast, sweetling. We owe our mutual friend a great debt, one that I promised to repay over suckling pig and ale. Sister, have you forgotten where you are? I have a right to happiness, Elreach. Or am I to play nursemaid forever, you ungrateful pup? Happiness, yes. But you embarrass yourself nightly, heaving and sweating with this hamhock. Hold your tongue, boy. Lest we both speak our truths. What truth have you to speak? That you've returned to this fickle man who abandoned you years ago for a Frankish pet? A woman he paid this yeah, dame to abduct in shit. that lamish shadow play? Mind yourself, boy. 
He is talking. Or that you let him so. sniff and paw you and take him to your bed on the promise of nothing? The whole of Essex whispers now. He's married still. His wife freshly stole him, and you are no more than. than his. I am the mother of his child, you whelp! Child? Oh. Alvida? This is how they find out. Please, my boy, I. I. I will never forgive you for this. Never. What is happening? Oh my god. <laughs> my lord, joyous news. God smiles upon us this very day. Estrid has been found by Alfred's men. They ride to her rescue as we speak. Huh? I will not let this plot be undone. Nothing is safe till they are away to Frankia. I will fix this, and one day I will call on you, and you will come. You can count on it, my friend. That's not like a threat. I wanted to tell you so many times. Hush, Angel. Do not fret so. He hates me. What have I done? We must go after him. He will not stray far, Lamb. Much has been said this day. If... Our son. We must believe he will return to us. So they were... Oh my god. Oh my god. That's a weird way to find out that that's back to your dad. Oh no. With a wreck. Imagine finding out that your father, that's your father, oh my god, that's so, damn, bro. Estrid is so close to freedom. I hope I'm not too late. <laughs> what happened? Rolo! Alfred's men have found you! What? How can this be? Lork. Stand by Estrid, guard her with your life. If she's taken, all is lost for us and Beeston. Come, lady. It would not do for them to take you back. Watch out! Look! <laughs> oh, no! Wait, so was he? Okay. Release the woman, Danes! If she's unharmed, we may have some of you live! Protect Estrid! <laughs> Oh, I killed the fuck out of you. Death to the Saxons! 
In Assassin's Creed? How will the enemy throw you? Bro, that's not a fucking legal move. I promised I would free you of your life in Wessex. Frankia awaits your return. Go now, with Aegir's blessing. I will miss you, Eivor. When winter has passed, summer will come, and wind you in a flowered skirt. For you are beauty, and shall not wither. Goddess Freya, give me more of that. Come, take care of her, Rollo Stoutheart. And if you find yourself on England's shores again, I will expect you in my hall. Good. They are safe. Bearst and Garazan of Oregon. And Esther is to Frankia. I should return to Runley. Alright. That is a good place to. Uh, I don't know. That's a good place for something. I don't know though. Let's go back to Rambi. Before that, let me see something. Don't worry, don't worry. Just trying to see a little something. You feel me? Okay, I get it. Uh, hey, Eivor! 
go talk to Ron V, see what's up. Eivor, out the gate. Alright. This is probably the best time to leave it. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to stop the stream here. Yeah, I'm going to stop the stream here. Um, yeah. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next stream. You feel me? Um, and yeah. I'm going to see you guys in the next stream. Alright. Peace.